Thanks to everyone who has subscribed. If you have not, please do. And thanks for coming out here. I really appreciate you. People Democratic Party governors tell Obohari Ainek what to do about a dual pose. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whatever time we're reaching you today. A uh, very big thank you for being so supportive. We truly, really appreciate you. By the way, don't forget to give a token of goodness, kindness, make someone smile today. Uh, that would be very good because you have made somebody's day. Anyway, the People Democratic Party uh, people, ha uh, governors have come, you know, to Buhari to say this is what uh, should be done in Edo elections and um, to INEC, this is what should be done. You know, because a lot of speculations are going on with regards to uh, uh, federal might. There's a lot of issues going on and people don't want to hear of these things. In an election, it should be free, fair, and there should be transparency and everyone should be able to, you know, uh, judge the system credible without fear or favor. You know, so if one party is trying to make the elections uh, fraudulent that is not what democracy is about you don't use the power of your office to impose on people or the people you don't use that to take advantage of them to you know uh, impose your choice or decision on them it is there is a reason why it's called democracy so that everyone can have a say and like it says uh you know uh, democracy is a game of numbers anyway guys let's get into the news and get all the details pdp governors tell buhari Ainek what to do about edo polls the people of edo state must be given a free fair and credible governorship election on September the 19th. The Governor's Forum of the People Democratic Party PDP had said, the forum made this known in a unique letter to the end to convey the message to President Muhammadu Buhari, the chairman of the forum and governor of Sokoto State, Amir Waziril Tambowa, has mentioned this. According to the governors, President Muhammad Buhari's security agencies and the Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, must ensure that the election is not rigged or married by violence. The governors noted that all stakeholders must play impartial roles to ensure a transparent process in a do and undo state. They also advise PDP supporters to stay out of violence and ensure that the votes are counted at all voting units and the winners are announced. According to the Governor's Forum decision, also results to the conclusion of the Constitution and Legislative Legal Process Committee and Legal Affairs Committee to erase and fine tune the governorship election in Edo State to give Governor Gordon Obaseki every support he will need during this election. They also advise other party to do the same with their candidates. It should be a credible, fair election. And as such, people should not use their supporters to come and cause violence in Edo State. Edo State needs to be a determinant of what Buhari has been saying about transparency. This will, many, this will showcase if truly he stands by what he's saying as all eyes, eyes on Edo State and the governor the government and Buhari must make sure that a do state election determine what really happens with regards to our democracy. Well, Nigerians, you've heard it. The governor for governor's forum of uh, People Democratic Party has said that um, a do state elections must be free and fair, and that um, they must make sure that everything is done decently and in order. It must be done credible and the people of Edo State must know there must be no violence of any kind. Why? Because Buhari has been saying his administration came on the back of transparency. The transparency must be visible, must be clear for all to see, especially with these elections. The governors have stated it here, reiterated it loud and clear to President Muhammad Buhari saying, you must make sure that these elections are done decently and in order. The People Democratic Party had a meeting and they, they did not just talk about their meeting. They said every other 
uh, uh, party has the opportunity to support whoever they want to support. And don't forget that there is another big party also uh, at stake in this election, talking about the party of the president himself, the person of Pastor Sage Ize Iyamo. Is also a contender in this election and it belongs to the APC party. So they are saying the governors should give the opportunity for credible, fair election. The president should give the opportunity so that everyone can have a transparent system. And at the end of the day, it will be all smiles and Nigerian can be declared credible for the election for once in a long time. Well, the governor's forum went ahead to explain that the world is watching, everyone is watching to see how President Muhammad Buhari will indeed allow a credible, free, fair election. And also INEC, they need to determine if they are going to allow for transparency, INEC has also been called upon to make sure that this election process is a credible one, is a free one, and Nigerians see that our government are not taking sides or because Buhari is from a party. But anybody who wins this election should become the governor of Edo State. There are no favors. There are no, I mean, if any of the members win, they should you know who the cap fits should go on and wear the cap. Whoever emerges the winner of a do state election should rule a do state. And so they are calling on uh, President Muhammad Buhari and every other party members to, you know, make sure that these elections are credible. They are calling on INEC to make sure that they do their job diligently. Do not encourage any form of violence. And even if, um, you know, security agencies that will come should not be people who will come to mastermind, you know, um, violence of any kind. They should allow the elections to go on, allow the vote of the people of Edo State to be heard. Their voices should be heard, meaning that Edo State should be given the opportunity to choose their governor. It's very important. The whole world is watching. Everyone is watching to see what these elections will be, the credibility and how it will turn out. And so we are to make sure do not give opportunities for, you know, uh, people to, you know, the world to look at our elections and say we are a fraudulent people. Uh, Buhari has been called, he had been admonished, and then um, the, the Governor's Forum of the People Democratic Party will be sending him a message to say, please allow this process to be free and fair and let everyone have a voice, you know, in this election process. Don't, you know, there should be no manipulation of any kind. Everyone should be able to speak up for what is right. Well, Edo State, uh, President Muhammad Buhari, APC, PDP, everyone has heard. Everyone has heard the election must be credible. The election must be one that people are looking up to and people, you know, can say indeed transparency is the order of the day in Nigeria. We need to give ourselves the opportunity to be the best at all times. Anyway, thank you very much. God bless you. Don't forget to like or share, subscribe. Click on the notification button so you can get all our latest news. God bless you. Bye for now.